Hi, my name is Alex Cheeseman. I'm with the Central Washington University Accessibility Studies Program. Did you know that about 13% of all United States public school students um, receive special education services? That's about 6.7 million students, all of whom are guaranteed a free and appropriate public education through their 21st birthday. Of those 6.7 million, about a quarter of them will go through what's called the transition program. So from age 18 to 21, they're learning social skills, they're learning vocational skills, they're learning independent living skills, um, skills that will help them lead a life that is as autonomous as possible. What I did was I interviewed a community-based transition center from the Muckleteo School District in Everett, Washington. Um, the goal here was to see if there's any issues or roadblocks that they see in the hiring of students with, with exceptionality, or if there's any issues that they see um, that can make the program better and programs like them better around the country and around the state. One that was identified was parent involvement. And what I'm advocating for is for a program much like um, the Promise Neighborhoods that the United States government supports, um, which is a program in low socioeconomic uh, areas, students with uh, challenging and diverse needs just like students with special needs are. Um, what I'm advocating for is a program that helps parents um, understand how they can be the best parent, how they can serve their child's needs best, um, and how they can support them as they move towards independence. So would you, would you join me in advocating for these programs to become commonplace in districts around the country? Because we need them, we need the diversity that they bring into our communities, and they need us. Thank you.